my God, I know this is something new for me because I do not know how to pray to you on camera. I don't do like the pagans do. And I apologize for even feeling I need to do it like the pagans do to prove something to the devils. Because they shouldn't even be requiring it. That tells you who they are. And I shouldn't be obliging. But I'm going to ask you to restore my peace, most high God. I'm going to ask you to comfort me and deliver me as you continue to do. And protect me as you've always done. I ask you, most high God, to restore my peace right now, Father God. I ask you to deliver me and my son from the snares of the enemy right now, Father God. I ask you to take my enemies and you said wrath would be yours and vengeance would be yours. And I ask you to do what you will with my enemies, Father God. I don't even come to you and ask you. I read in the word a few weeks ago, you said vengeance is yours, which I already knew, but you were comforting me in vengeance would be yours. And I just said, yes, because I know what's been done to me and I know how you operate, Father. I know there's no stone unturned. I know you see everything. There is nothing you don't see and no one and no hand and no foot and no toe. You see it all. You seen him fire my son, most high God, and he ain't done nothing to nobody. You seen them take his income. So when it vibrates back to them, it is what you choose to give them, most high God. But you said that you would vindicate me. And I ask you to vindicate me, Father God. I ask you to continue to protect me, Father God. I ask you to continue to gird up my loins, Father God. I ask you to continue to touch me and anoint me and give me the power that is invested in me through you the most high God, the creator of all gods in the mighty name of Yeshua. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. 